Microgen and your company is the best thing that's happened in this space in as long as I've been in my career. You need to know about this technology and you need to know about it yesterday. For the majority of patients that I see with my complex urology practice, traditional antimicrobial culture testing and sensitivity has just failed to show me what I need. I was a little skeptical at first to see what this would bring. And what I was surprised so quickly after starting the therapy was not how many negatives there were, but how many positives there were. In fact, how few negatives there were. And to say that I have a traditional culture negative and I find two to five organisms on a microgen that I have to treat before I instrument or tell a patient that they're infection free, to me, that huge gap in information is something that I cannot fathom treating my patients without in the future. I never used to take the culture results into the patient. Now it's an exciting part of the patient teaching experience. You can show the three phases of it, the PCR phase, uh, genetic resistance patterns, and then the final evaluation with the usually multiple organisms and multiple sensitivities. It's sort of fun to say, okay, what's the one antibiotic or the fewest number of antibiotics I can come up with to get you on your course and get you treated. And let's decide how long based on your pattern and intensity of your disease. When you eradicate infection, the overall health impact of the patient, both from an economic and quality of life standpoint, is much improved because they're on antibiotics for a shorter amount of time, they're infection free and asymptomatic for a longer amount of time, and they have confidence that their infection's been treated. So it gives me the confidence to tell them, we got it this time. I talk to my colleagues about my Microgen, I say, this has revolutionized my practice. It will revolutionize your practice.